Greetings everybody. Today I'm going to do a comparison video between the Killer Body Lancer Evo by Mitsubishi and the Tamiya Lancer Evo by Mitsubishi. Now this is the Evo 10. I'm going to try to make this video shorter than seven minutes because that's all I have time for. On the left is the Killer Body, on the right is the Tamiya. Uh, I've already gone through and darkened in the highlighted lines to show you where the detail lies. Um, it was a little bit more difficult to get it done on the killer body version because the detail is not as very defined as it is on the Tamiya. Um, first, let's go into what is in the package for each company. So let's start off with the killer body. Of course, you've got the 10 scale clear body. You have spoiler. See if I can focus on that there. Okay, you've got the spoiler. You've got the bottom part of the rear diffuser. There's holes there for mufflers as well. You have your side view mirrors, and it also includes windshield wipers right here. So, putting that aside, you have these are your little brackets to hold your LEDs in place. Well, your lights, whether they be LED or not. All right, you got double sided tape in there as well, and you've also got aluminum tape. Aluminum back tape to hold the buckets in place. These are the light buckets. So you've got already spray painted chrome. You've got the light buckets for the front and the back. You've got exhaust tips here for. Just having a hard time focusing. Here we go. You got your exhaust tips there. I believe they go on this way, and they're screwed in from the other end. And. You also have your emblems, your Mitsubishi emblems right here. And on this side you have your mirrors that'll go into the side of your mirrors. It's actually chrome plastic. Putting that aside, now you have instruction booklet. This is what their stock body looks like. Instruction booklet, masking, goes into detail. And we'll do next the decals or decals depending on where you come from I call them stickers but as you can see they're already pre-cut and there's not that many of them but I don't really use that many so that's okay I like to use more paint over here you have a Tamiya body which has a little bit more detail than the Lancer by Killer Body but not much more and by the way they're going about the same price point which is a little bit more than forty dollars. Um, the killer body version might be just a little bit more, a little bit less by maybe two or three dollars. So over here, you also get side view mirrors for your money, but they're not chromed out, so you have to paint them. This is the mirror portion; you have to paint that as well. Over here is your spoiler for the rear. It comes white. You have to paint that. This is your instruction booklet. Also, like the killer body, very detailed. Now, to me, it's been around for many years. On the market so they've had a lot of time to perfect this their bodies are very sturdy and the killer body has taken a good lesson from Tamiya and their bodies are also sturdy as well now you have with the Tamiya you've also got your screws pins tape you got the same brackets to hold in your light buckets and your wiring and here your light buckets for front and back you don't get any side any um windshield wipers with this and you don't get any mufflers with this but your decal sheet your sticker sheet is sorry bump the camera apologize your sticker sheet is well detailed and this is actually pre-cut as well usually to me stickers are not pre-cut a lot of people don't like that that's a point where people get turned away from Tamiya. but if you look at the sticker sheet side by side you do get more with the um, Tamiya sheet because they also accommodate stickers going on the outside and on the inside of your light buckets. So if you don't want to paint on your... Don't, you don't want to actually put light buckets in there. You can paint them on and they'll accommodate that. But there's your sticker sheet. That's pretty much what you're looking at there. But going back to the bodies. This is your Tamiya body. Top view. Rear view. What you're looking at there come back over to your killer body again front view 
top view, side view, and of course your rear view. So looking at them together, let's put everything aside here, they are almost identical. Let's line them up, nose to nose, and come to the rear, almost the same size. And to me it has it maybe by a few millimeters in length. Let's see, we lined up here. Okay, so we're lined up about right here. To me it's just got it by a few millimeters. But overall, that's the review. Hope you liked the video. Leave comments below, let me know what you think. Alright guys, thanks.